Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Danielle and I designed my own day planner. this video for a couple months now I am so excited to finally announce it I kind of hinted at it in a video a couple weeks ago and some of you caught on you little sneaky people but I am so excited this video is going to be all how I plan how I use my planner if you guys have been watching my vlogs for a while you would know I use the doing well daily it was my last one was a purple one it was her initial or she had volume one volume two I used the volume two one and I fell in love with it. It was in all my vlogs. I used it every morning so much so that the founder of Doing Well Daily reached out to me and we became friends. And she was like, do you want to collaborate? And I was like, yes. The one product I've always wanted to come out with was a day planner. And then I found this one that I freaking love to use, but it needed some more school stuff for me because I'm also a student, as you guys know. And she was like, let's do one that's more catered towards students that also have like a side hustle or whatever it may be. But if also, if you're if you're not a student, it's completely okay because we have nothing that says like school on it. It's just like different sections. Anyways, I'm getting too excited. I'm talking too much about it. But anyways, she reached out to me and she was like, do you want to collaborate and make a planner? And I was like, heck to the yes, let's freaking go. Um, so it's been a dream, honestly. So we came out with this day book, Doing Well Daily, Times Danielle Carolyn, yellow cover, of course, because it's my favorite color. You guys, I am so excited and I'm just so thankful that I got this opportunity. I love stuff like this where it's something you genuinely love to use and you get to collaborate and like create your own product that's like perfect for what you think a lot of people would want to use. And it's perfect for my lifestyle at least. So I am so excited. I was literally running, I had like two pages left of my last doing well daily. And I was like, I want my own to come in so soon because I needed a new one. So I've used two of these pages already. I've just started. So a lot of you guys have been asking, like what planner do you use? Will you make a planner video? Like how you daily plan? And I've been just holding off because I wanted to show you guys how I use this one because this, I literally created it for exactly what I want for my mornings. So it's a great way to start your morning. I can't wait to show you guys. Basically, I'm gonna take you guys along on my morning. Tomorrow morning, I'm gonna film this. So I'm pre-filming this little intro. I'm gonna take you guys along my morning with my morning coffee and everything, planning out my day, my mindset, how I go about it. It's a day planner, but also you don't have to do it on every day. I'll show you guys more on the close-ups, but there's one full down each page, but you can literally write the date. There's no specific days on it, which is nice because some days you might be trying to have a lazy day and you don't want to have to have a whole to-do list or anything like that. That's the beauty of this. There are 90 days on here, so you could technically make it like three months, but there's no pressure. I don't always use mine on the weekends, so it's kind of nice. It usually lasts longer than three months too. I just think it is so important to start every morning off grateful, inspired, motivated, and also just kind of write everything down so you can like start the day right. And I think this book allows you to have that perfect morning routine. And the awesome thing is on each day you have a new personal growth quote or phrase that I picked out every single one of them. So with that, those are quotes and phrases that mean a lot to me, that motivate me. They're a great way to start your day. They're awesome because they're very traceable if you like to color things in. There's so many things you can color in everything like that. I am just so excited. I literally have just been like on cloud nine. Sydney, the founder of Doing Well Daily, is like my new best friend. We have had so many Zoom calls planning this. This isn't something I just put my name on. It was something that I put my heart into along with Sydney and we really just created, I mean, she hand wrote all of this. She's freaking amazing. So I will have a link down below to the planner, I'm about to show you guys in depth how I use this and everything. So yeah, as you guys are watching this, this will be going on sale on Friday, December 4th. So keep that on your calendar. So technically Thursday, midnight Eastern Standard Time, which would be basically Friday. Um, so yeah, I wanted to give you guys some time to think about it and look at it and everything, but it will be going on sale this Friday. And I am so excited. I'm so grateful. And it's just something that I've always wanted to do, design my own day planner, because I use them. It's just, it's just, you guys are gonna see this on my vlogs every day. So. Happy Vlogmas, happy planner release day. So excited, they are $42 on their website and you also get the brush pen included, which is like you literally need the brush pen. Like you need it, like to trace it. Oh, it is so satisfying you guys. Oh, so excited. Anyways, that's my little intro. How many times can I do this? I'm so excited, I'm so thankful for this opportunity. Oh, also one last thing, if you're asking for this for Christmas or you're getting it for summer for Christmas, if you order before December 16th, you will be guaranteed to get it by Christmas, so. That's kind of the deadline on that, if you guys were wondering. And yeah, it's great quality, it feels so good. I just gave Delaney hers and she was like, oh my gosh. I am so thankful, I'm so excited. So without further ado, let's get on into how I plan and start my morning. All right, you guys, just made my morning coffee. Cheers, good morning to you if you're planning alongside of me. 
ASMR. <laughs> it is 9.36 a.m. We are doing this together. Do not mind my morning voice. I just wanted this to be super real. Me planning my morning. Here she is, the planner herself. My doing well daily. I'm so beyond happy with this. It is literally everything I could want. And I am just so excited to plan with you guys. So as mentioned, you do get a felt brush pen that comes with your order for free. It is amazing. You can also just find them on Amazon, but um, you will get one when you order this book. It is just, oh my gosh, it is so fun to write with. All right, so we are just going to open it up. <laughs> I'm so excited. So this is what you see when you first open the book. We have my favorite quote ever, which is she believed she could, so she did. It has gotten me through so much of my life. If you guys have been around for a while, you know how much this quote means to me. She believes she goes, so she did. Simple as that. It's basically just believing in yourself. I, we designed this print as well. I love this like black speckled print. A little note for me to you. Yes, that's my signature. It's not that good. I'm aware. <laughs> then when you first open the page, this is what you're going to see every day. However, this is an example that I created so you guys can kind of get an idea of, you know, if you're losing inspiration or you're just kind of curious of what goes in each box, because I understand it can be a little confusing. This is my little example page. As you can see, baby carrots, kombucha, very on brand. These are things that I would actually put in my actual to-do list. And if you're still confused, there is a how-to page for each section, like for gratitude, what are you grateful for today? Affirmations, it's real important to hype yourself up, jot down one of three pieces of self-love. Then I have a ton of lists of affirmations here. Just a ton of ideas, for example, I inspire those around me. I will choose compassion. Just all kinds of things. If you can't think of things to, you know, affirm yourself. Examples of acts of kindness, because there is an acts of kindness section where you write down something that you're going to do for someone else that day. Moods, all kinds of moods that you could possibly feel. And then in front of every 30 pages, We've got this. You have a monthly little situation here. So if you have certain dates or certain things, a lot of people really still like this. I personally use my Google Calendar more, but I know some people do like to still be visual about it. So, and the beauty of this is there's no set dates, no set months of when you need to use this. You can write 2020, you can write 2021 if you're getting this for the new year. No problem, you literally can write the dates. It's pretty magical in that sense. Then you also are gonna do your monthly goals. So you have mind, body, work, and other just like a cool way to kind of write down your goals for that month. I like to do that. Then you get on in to the first page. I've already done a couple pages, so we're going to skip to the next blank one. One of my favorite things is waiting until the next morning to see what today's, you know, saying or quote is on the personal growth section. So today's is, if you're waiting for a sign, this is it. Oh, I love that. Like I said, I also curated every single one of these. So these are all very me quotes I guess you could say are things that I think you guys really like so this is what the blank one looks like usually where I like to start is this side so this is the more motivational happy side and then this is the more you know hustle get after the day side and so I like to start on this side sometimes I'll fold it up even just so I can truly focus let me take another sip of my coffee <laughs> first things first I like to write down the day of the week that's what this top section is for. A lot of people love to just doodle everywhere. Totally up to you. Um, so today is Tuesday, December 1st. You guys are literally watching this the next day. So happy Vlogmas. Um, so I also just, let me tell you guys, even though like I designed this and everything, I you would think I would have amazing handwriting. I don't. This is all Sydney's handwriting, the founder of Doom Hill Daily. Yeah, so just, just know. I don't have the best handwriting. I'm working on it. But this pen definitely makes you feel dope. So... Tuesday is the day. I just like to write it in big, bold letters. It is so satisfying to draw with this brush pen, you guys. Yay! Tuesday. Pretty simple, you know. And today is December 1st. Ah, so we're going to do 12, 1. Oh, why did I do my one like that? I don't know. Now let's do both ones like that. So yeah, also, that's the amazing thing. If you don't want to do this on the weekends, you don't have to. Or if you're having a lazy Friday, you don't have to do it. You can literally just put whatever date you want. Now, I like to start my morning off with gratitude because I think that is so important. I think if you start your day with a grateful heart and a grateful mind, you just have a better day. Your mindset's better. Just thinking about even the smallest of things, I think it's so important. So it is 35 degrees out right now, and I'm from Florida. I live in Georgia right now for college, and I am 
so beyond obsessed with cold weather because I barely get it. So definitely today I am grateful for cold weather. You can either write one long one, you can write two. I'm gonna do three just to show you guys. I usually try to think of three, even just like super little things that I'm thankful for. Two, honestly, I'm really thankful for this opportunity for my planner launch. And already just by like writing this down, it's like making me just in the best mood and I feel like I'm just gonna have a great day. Three, I'm thankful for y'all. I'm thankful for my Dan fam. But then some mornings I'll literally say like a hot cup of coffee because sometimes coffee just hits diff, you know? Whatever it may be, it can be the smallest of things. Sometimes I'll say like Christmas music or my family, my health, whatever it may be, whatever you're feeling really grateful for that day, pop that ish down. Next up, we've got affirmations. And affirmations are definitely not like always on the top of my mind and it's something I'm trying to work on, which is why I added this in the planner. So I'll pr usually go to the affirmations list because I need some inspo here. I'm really stressed about some labs I have to get done for my textiles testing class. So I think today's affirmation is going to be, I accomplish anything I focus on. And then say it a couple of times out loud or since this is on my planner, I'll like repeat it to myself or in my head a couple times a day. Word, I accomplish anything I focus on. Boom. Next up, I feel like it's everyone's favorite. If you have it doing well daily already, you totally know. This is the tracing part. I love this because not only do you get a new phrase every day, but by tracing it, I feel like it truly allows you to kind of manifest it into your day and really let it set and kind of think about it. And it's just so soothing and satisfying um, to trace, especially with this brush pen. So we're gonna go for it. And some days, Sydney will have drawn, you know, letters like this. Other days, it'll be more cursive. It's really fun, really satisfying, and you feel like you yourself are a calligraphy artist. Ah, that is just so much fun. <laughs> and also, sometimes if I'm like bored or if I'm just like in Zoom class and I just want something to do with my hands, you can take other colors and trace around this or make it pretty, like some people literally paint, or like not paint, draw the most beautiful photos behind the quote. Like you can really have fun with this. I also added these stars for a personal touch because always into stars. <laughs> Next up is self care. I wanted there to be a section where you could jot down your workout for the day, but also if you're not working out that day and you just want to like do a face mask, I feel like this is the best section for that. There shouldn't be pressure to like work out every single day because that's not realistic, honestly. I mean, at least not for me. Like on the last Dream Well Daily, she had like a get moving section. Same idea, you know, get your get moving somehow. How are you gonna get moving? Go for a walk, whatever it may be. So here I'll usually write down how I'm gonna get moving and like how I'm gonna treat my body well, whether that's going for a walk to get a green smoothie or doing a face mask or taking a bath. Literally any sort of self-care that feels right for you, you can write down. So for me today, I'm gonna do the 12 3 30 challenge, which I've just been starting. I was inspired by Lauren Geraldo's TikTok, where you put the incline on the treadmill at 12, speed of three for 30 minutes. And um, it's super, I mean, it's not super easy, but um, you know, it's doable. I just listened to a podcast. So that's gonna be my workout for today. And then also I wanna do an Olaplex treatment on my hair today when I shower, which is just basically like a, a good old hair mask. And also gonna take a ginger shot because I think I've got one in my fridge. So you can just write one thing, you can write three things, you can write two things. Like it literally does not matter, but those are the three things that I wanna do for my body today. My body and hair, I guess. <laughs> also keep in mind, usually I'll sit in my living room or in my room depending on and put like the Yule log on my TV, like a fireplace vibe with like light music, but obviously we're doing this together, so. But yeah, definitely make the vibes right when you're doing this. All right, here you can write down how many cups of water you've had times eight ounces, essentially. So this is how much I suggest you have a day. Fun fact, if you have, I mean, this is just basic math, but if you have one of the 40 ounce hydro flasks, if you drink one of those, that is equal to five of these droplets right here. So I haven't drank a whole one yet, but I have had one glass of water I tried to when I first wake up. So we'll fill that guy in and you try to fill it out throughout the rest of the day. Can't lie, I don't always keep up with this because I don't have this with me 100% of the day, but you know, we're home a lot more. So it's definitely like a way to keep track. All right, next up, mood. I am so freaking motivated and excited today because it's the start of Vlogmas 
and I'm just in a really good mood and I'm just so excited about this. Honestly, today I'm just excited. I'm excited, I'm excited. But again, there is also a list of moods in the beginning of the book that you can refer to if you are struggling on how you're feeling or maybe you just can't put it into words. So definitely make sure to check this out if you're ever kind of at a loss of words. But I also wanted the mood section to be, it could be like your outfit mood, like loungewear or chic or edgy, bold, whatever it could be. It could be your song mood. Like what kind of music do you want to listen to today? Like jazz vibes or more of, you know, I don't know, rap. <laughs> like in my example here, I showed feeling optimistic outfit simple chic music lo-fi chill hip-hop lo-fi chill hip-hop sorry i don't know how to say it or you can also write like what kind of podcast you're in the mood to listen to content you want to take in any sort of mood go for it that's for you now for act of kindness you guys it is so good for the soul for yourself and for others to do an act of kindness every day this could be the simplest of things as of calling a family member or holding the door for the person behind you or a popular one is paying it forward and buying the coffee for the person behind you in the drive-thru. I came up with a list of a ton of different act of kindness ideas. These are all super easy, simple ones. Not all of them involve like paying money because I know we all are not made of money. Could be cooking for your roommate or picking up the trash. Donating blood, that's so big right now. Take a photo for someone, make a playlist for a friend, whatever it may be. There are so many. Leave a positive comment on social media. There's so many ideas and it really inspires you to do something good every day and I truly believe that it feels good for you and it also feels good for the other person. So today my act of kindness is going to be sending flowers to someone. So we're gonna put that down right here. Spoiler alert, I'm sending flowers to Sydney who is the founder of Doing All Daily and who I did everything with and not only is she a girl boss and created this with me, but she also is moving into a new house today and is literally about to have a baby. So she is incredible and I'm so thankful to her. So I wanna send her some flowers. I wanna send her some sunflowers because the cover is yellow and I thought that would go. So hopefully, Sydney, if you're watching this, you already got your flowers, we'll see. <laughs> All right, so this is the motivational page. We are now inspired, we are motivated, we are feeling grateful. Now we can move on to the nitty gritty, which is the get after the day section. Well, technically this is the get after the day, but I kind of call this whole thing get after the day, you know? Need more coffee, one second. All right, so this page is very important to me because I have a lot of different things I do in my life in the sense of like school and my side hustle and just life, I have things. I needed a lot of just different lists and sections and this is perfect. Like I literally, this is, I really hope you guys like this too because this is just perfect. We are gonna start on the get after the day section. So this is just the hourly thing, which was, I think it's nice to have. I do use Google Calendar for more timely things. However, I believe it, it's kind of nice to see things laid out, to write it down so you really have your day in your head. So it starts at 6 a.m. and then we go all the way to 8 p.m. I don't fill every hour out, I just put things that I know I'm doing at certain times and after that I just kind of, you know, do it. So yeah, this is when I will pull out my Google Calendar and take a look. So right now it is 9.56, just for effect we'll say film plan with me. After this I want to shower and make breakfast, kind of that vibe. Again, some mornings I'll be more specific, other mornings I'll literally just be like, class at two. You know, like it doesn't matter, it's totally up to you. I, you probably will never see me do the 6 a.m. I don't like to wake up past, or like before 7 a.m., I'm just not like that, but I know a lot of you guys are <laughs> go-getters in that sense, so I wanted there to be some earlier hours for you all. And then from 12 to like three, I really want to grind on schoolwork. I have some, like I said, some labs due this week. I also have a paper due early next week. I need to start studying for finals and I need to edit this video to go up tomorrow. So from 12 to three, I want to um, basically just hustle and do a lot of work, probably just here and make some more coffee. So I'll say grind. So yeah, I'm just blocking off all that time. So this is definitely by the hour, it's not by the half hour. I'm getting a spray tan with my girl Jess. And then at seven, I'm hanging out with Ryan. Ryan's my boyfriend if you guys did not know. <laughs> so yeah, that's kind of the outline. I'll fill things in as needed, but that's kind of what we're doing today. Then we've got life to do section. This is like, I just wanted a section where I could write down like 
random errands I wanted to get done, random things I needed to do. So I know I need to go to CVS and get more deodorant because I'm out. So I need to do a CVS run and I need to get deodorant. So glamorous, I know. And then there's something else I needed to get. Oh, um, razor heads. Oh, oh, nope. I need to design my family's Christmas card. I told my mom I would do that. They're honestly really fun to design, so I also need to do that today. Now, this is like the best thing I could ever have in my planner. A work and a side hustle to-do list. Two different ones, there's very faded circles because some people like to check off their to-do list or some people like to cross it off. Um, so it's completely up to you on how you wanna do that. You can trace the circles if you want, go off. But, so yeah, basically I wanted there to be one that I could have for my schoolwork and one for my side hustle. However, I know some of you guys aren't students and I didn't, I don't know, I wanted everyone to feel like this is for them. So I felt like work and side hustle made a little bit more sense. So for me, work means schoolwork and then side hustle means YouTube, podcast, kind of all that stuff. You know, basically you have two different to-do lists. So for work, I have schoolwork. I need to get done my labs. They are due this Friday. I also need to get some discussion questions done for my soft goods class. I also have a quiz this Thursday, so I need to start studying for that in that same class. And I try not to overload myself. Like I try to just write down the things that I genuinely think I can get done today because if it's just like an overwhelming list, I'm not gonna get it all done. However, sometimes like, Throughout the day, I'll be like, oh, I also need to do this, so I'll write it down. That's what's nice. Then we've got side hustle, my favorite, you know, little list, naturally. Um, so, for YouTube podcast, all of my fun social media stuff, I have to edit this video and upload it, because I'm uploading every day until Christmas for you. Edit, plan with me. That actually might be it, guys. Do I have anything else I need to do? Film, I recorded my podcast yesterday. Gals in the Go podcast, shout out. Oh, I need to take more pictures of this planner. Oh, and I wanted to make a TikTok <laughs> of this and like show how to use it. So, um, yeah, make TikTok. And other than that, I think we are good. This is today, every day is completely different. My mood's different, what I have to do is different, everything like that, but I thought it would be really fun to kind of just do this super organic, wake up literally with morning voice coffee and show you guys me using this and i am so freaking excited about it again this goes on sale this friday midnight eastern standard time so like this so thursday night at midnight it's kind of hard you, you know what i mean um so it's 42 dollars. you get this book and then you also get this brush pen that comes with it 90 pages so it could technically be for three months however mine always lasts longer because i don't always use mine on the weekends or sometimes just sunday mornings i don't always do it saturday morning whatever it may be you know so yeah i am so excited um for you guys to experience this yourself i'm so freaking thankful for this opportunity i've wanted to design a planner for so long and this is literally exactly what i could want in my everyday so it's just perfect i'll have a link down below doingwelldaily.com thanks for planning with me all right you guys that was how i start my morning every day it's such an amazing way to start your your day your week whatever it may be again you don't have to use it every day you can write down the date whenever you want and just get after it you just write the little date right you're the day like monday tuesday wednesday right there i love it it's the perfect size i'm just so excited about it it's great for the new year if you want to start the new year off with it whatever it may be but yeah, doingwelldaily.com, going on sale this Friday, December 4th. Get excited, because I am so excited for you guys to like, ah! so Yeah, tag me in your Instagram stories, send me pictures when you get them. I hope this motivates you, because this has really changed my life. It's changed my mindset. It is so important for me in the morning to start my day off grateful, motivated, and this just allows all of that. So it's awesome. I'm so excited to share this with you guys, because I think it's just amazing so yeah i love you guys so much thank you so much for watching happy vlogmas a new vlog will be up tomorrow and i'll see you guys tomorrow subscribe <laughs> bye guys